Hello YouTube, this is LI Infidel Airsofters with another review. This is of the HFC M9. This is older and it is not full auto. This gun is almost completely constructed of metal besides these little hand guards on the side of the pistol grip. On the side of the grip, I should say. Um, it comes with a metal magazine, 30 round, double stacked. Um, it's nice, it's heavy, it adds most of the weight to the gun. As we all know, you put the green gas in the little hole in the bottom. This one, right here. Um, okay. Magazine releases right here. These, I, like I said, this is the only plastic part on the entire gun. And they don't appear to come off. I'm not sure, though, because they, you know, they don't look like they can be unscrewed in any way besides these. But those don't really do anything. It's double action. Or, if you pull the, you know, you can pull the slide back or... Pull the hammer back, and it'll make the trigger pull a little bit easier. Besides, that's the double action. That's the regular. That's with the gun cocked. Um, like I said, most of the gun is metal. Um, the outer barrel is plastic. The inner barrel is obviously metal. The orange tip right here was orange. Now it's sharpied over black. I'm gonna paint it with decent spray paint when I get a chance. Um, it'll work for now. It, it makes it the gun just look a little bit nicer. It's got the rail right here. Um, you can put a little flashlight, laser, etc. The sights are painted. I did not paint them. They came factory like that. Um, yeah, they're nice. They're bad. I actually like these more than the 1911 sights just because they're nicer. And the 1911, the whole slide moves. This just the this the slide moves, but the outer barrel stays the same. Doesn't make sense, but to me it does. Um, to disassemble the gun, you pull the slide back, lock it, then pop this little tab down, and the whole barrel will slide that way. The outer barrel and assembly slide, most of that stuff will just slide that way. Um, when the red dot is shown, it's on safety. When the dot is covered, it's on... Uh, Sorry about that. When the dot is shown, it's on fire, and when the dot is covered up, it's on safety. Therefore, you cannot pull the trigger at all. It'll just go straight back. The slider release is metal. The little tab thing is metal. Um, the back of the is metal, and it's textured. The whole gun is basically textured. There's a texture of little finger notches right here, so when you pull the slide back, it's a little bit easier to get a grip. Um, yeah, that's most of this gun. The internals are pretty solid. I mean, this gun doesn't definitely does have a harder kickback than that, my 1911. See my Guitar Hero guitar in the background. Um, you know, this whole frame right here is one piece, obviously. It may look like this can come off, but for you new guys at Airsoft, this is not, you know, me and my friend Nick have been playing for two years, and, well, almost three years now, and, uh, you know, these are my, this is my, one of my first couple gas blowback pistols, and I do enjoy this one, and this is not one piece, you cannot change this part out unless you get an entire new frame, which I do not suggest, because you can just buy another new gun for that money. Alright, this has been Steven with the LI Infidel Airsoft, and uh, make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks, bye.